Well, not only is today snack day, today is also inauguration day in the United States. Anyway, they swear in their 45th president today, President Donald Trump. And the rest of the world shakes its collective heads and sighs. We know how it feels, though. We can empathize with them. Here in Canada, we also have a seemingly useless, self-absorbed, kiss everyone's ass in public and do what you want in private leader. They'll get used to it, just like we are. In other more important news, NBC is officially bringing back Will and Grace for a 10 episode limited run next season. How about that? Eric McCormack, Deborah Messing, Sean Hayes and Megan Mullally are all back for this 2017-2018 run. And the original series creator Max Muchnick and David Cohen return, as well as director James Burroughs. Everybody! James Burroughs, by the way, directed every single episode of the show during its initial eight-year run. <laughs> by now, you know how I feel about this whole thing. But it's not technically a reboot. Not really. It's more like a patching up the same old, old, old boots. Then they'll take a few months off and start working on the reunion special. <laughs> wow. Don't those programming geniuses at NBC ever take a break? Apparently not. Okay. If they're bringing it back, which one do you think will be the mandatory transgender character? It has to happen. Do you remember how the show ended anyway, do you? Because I'm a bit confused here. Will this whole thing take place before the 20-year flash forward in the 2006 final episode? Will it be an alternate timeline? A parallel universe? Or are they just going to ignore the whole thing even happened? Nah, I'm just playing with you. I don't actually care. In fact, I have to come clean here. I have to put my cards on the table. It's time. I won't feel right if I don't. The show may have run for eight years, but I can honestly say without any stretching, bending, or twisting of the truth, I have never seen a single episode. Not one. Couldn't get into it. Didn't even try to be truthful with you. In fact, I didn't even know who the main actors were until I was researching for this story. And I apologize if you were one of the, obviously many, regular viewers who kept this show going for eight years. Well, hey, congrats! It's back! <laughs> for the rest of us? Meh. What do you bet after the Trump administration they bring back the original Apprentice, too? After all, he hates what Arnold is doing to it. Sorry, uh, honesty must come in here again. Meh. Everybody knows Trump's presidency is only a prep session to get America ready for Ivanka to take over anyway. Look at the signs, then mark my words and get ready to hide. Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. Really, by then, who knows what kind of ghetto Trudeau will have turned Canada into anyway. We will survive, as long as there's good TV. As always, send us a comment, give us a like, share our links, and hit that subscribe button. Play safe. We'll catch you here next time. Click on the square to the right to watch the latest video. Click on the square to the left for a random one we think you'll like. And click on that circle icon in the middle to subscribe. Thank you for watching ABZ Today and supporting our YouTube channel.